Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. After completing the basic form customization within a template, you can click the Additional Customization button to set additional form customization options within the Additional Customization window. The Additional Customization window uses several tabs to display different sets of options for customizing the various sections of the selected type of form. Each area within the form is represented by a tab. Click on the name of the tab that corresponds to the area of the form that you would like to customize. Next, check or uncheck the checkboxes next to the names of the fields underneath the Screen and Print columns to show or hide their display within both the Screen version of the form, where you perform data entry, and the Print version of the form, which is the version that you print. Then you can enter the titles that you want to display for those fields into the adjacent text boxes. Note that for some fields you can have a field that appears in one version but not the other if desired. So for example if you have a custom field that you want to enable within the screen version so that you can enter or view information but you don't want the customer to see this information within the printed version then select the screen checkbox for that field and clear the print checkbox. For any tabs that display columnar information, such as the Columns tab, you can also change the order that the columns are displayed from left to right within the line item area of the form by typing the desired number into the Order field. The columns will be arranged and displayed from left to right by the lowest to highest number. To apply print settings to the printed version of the template, click the Print tab. On this tab, you can specify default print settings for the template if desired. After performing additional customization of the form template, you can click the Layout Designer to change the display of elements within the printed version of the form template within the Layout Designer window that then appears. Alternately, you can click the OK button to return to the basic customization window. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.